Now some techno news from overseas. If you own a beta format VCR, you may have noticed that it's become increasingly difficult to buy or rent pre-recorded product on that format. The maker of the beta machine has noticed as well, and now Sony will market hardware in VHS for the first time. But as Brian Jenkins reports from Tokyo, Sony insists it will continue to back beta. When the Sony Betamax recorder hit video stores in 1975, it had virtually no competition. Then other Japanese firms came up with the VHS system, allowing longer recording times, and Sony's share of the VCR market worldwide slipped to its present level of less than 10%. A number of movie studios stopped releasing beta tapes. That discouraged consumers from buying new beta recorders and left Sony dealers calling for a VHS machine. As a leading manufacturer of videotape recorder, we think that it's our responsibility to meet with those diversifying demands of the customer. Some market analysts say the announcement spells the beginning of the end for the beta format. But Sony points out there are still about 25 million Betamax recorders in use around the world, more than 5 million of them in North America. Because of that, we think that is our, also our responsibility to maintain this Betamax uh, uh, for those customers, as well as for the new customers who think Betamax is the best system. Sony still believes the beta format provides better picture quality and is therefore the best system for taping TV shows. Sony will also continue development of its 8mm video camera, although it too has had disappointing sales. The camera can be hooked up to the beta or the new Sony VHS recorders for playback. Sony plans to introduce its VHS recorders in Europe this spring, in Japan this summer, and in the United States sometime before the end of the year. Brian Jenkins, CNN, Tokyo.